What's up guys, PG here, hope you're having a wonderful day. Today we're going to talk about HMC, take a look at the latest news that HMC just released, take a look if today will be earnings day for HMC, take a look if HMC can go to 1 in the future, because I've been getting a lot of questions asking me, can HMC go to 1 at the end of the year? Let's respond to all of that, let's take a look at all of that, and if you enjoy, leave a like, subscribe so you don't miss any HMC updates, and let's jump right into it. We can see that HMC is currently at 0.0022. Yesterday was a little red day. We can see if we take a look at five days. We had the big spike. We had the first big spike here to 0.023, 24 on Friday. Then we had the big spike on Monday to all the way up to 35. Then it's been going down from there. And yesterday we had once again little pullback, little setup. So um, I wouldn't be surprised to see HMC go once again to the 0.0018 zone. It's been trading there for weeks, past week. So um, I wouldn't be surprised to see it go back to those levels. People who um, who were talking about the May 3rd HMC day and uh, who got in on that day, some people took their profits, some people saw that it was up at 0 0.0030, took their profits, some people got in there, but um, we'll have to see in the long term who will be right and where HMC can go in the long term. Now the next big thing that everyone is looking for and looking forward to is the HMC lawsuit. People are waiting for a response of the judge if he will deny or grant the motion to dismiss. That will maybe help push the price a little bit. And uh, the big, big news will be if the judge, not the judge, but if HMC wins the lawsuit, if there's a settlement, that will be the big, big news. And people are asking me, will if HMC wins the lawsuit, will they go to one dollar? Now, if we make some calculations here, HMC is currently at 0 0.0022. So let's say now that we get some great news with the lawsuit and that X that HMC does X5, which can be perfectly possible. X5 wouldn't be that much to ask. X5 is pretty reasonable, pretty realistic. So if you do X5, the price would be at 0 0.01, and that's perfectly possible. No, not financial advice, but that's perfectly possible to see HMC at 0 0.01. If HMC wins the lawsuit, I wouldn't be surprised there to see them do X5. And uh, let's say that maybe they do X10, which is a little bit far stretch maybe, but X10 would be 0 0.022. That's also pretty realistic between 0 0.01 and 0 0.020. That's pretty realistic if they win the lawsuit, if you get some great news with the lawsuit. Now, if you get some, some spikes with the lawsuit, if the judge denies the motion to dismiss, maybe it can, it can double. So just double here at 0 0.044. That will also be possible that it doubles when we get the, the, when the judge denies the motion to dismiss, maybe we'll have some spikes double because we've seen it move, not a lot, but we'll still it move up and up to 0 0.0035 on HMC day at the opening of the market. So there are a lot of people interesting. The community is getting bigger and bigger. So um, people can move the price. So I'm very curious to see what will happen if they win the lawsuit. Now for HMC to go to $1, they're currently at 0 0.22. So they have to do X500. So X500, they will be at $1. That's a little far stretch, maybe X500. We've seen it happen with Dogecoin in a period of years, but uh, it's very, very rare because Dogecoin, we have billionaires talking about them. We have 1 million people following Dogecoin and uh, cryptocurrencies are moving so much. So um, everything can happen in this world, but uh, X500, it will have to be a major, major event. Big billionaires would be talking about it. and. Uh, We'll have to see, everything can happen in this world, but uh, X500 is far, far stretch, and uh, we'll have to see what, what happens, but uh, I wouldn't be less surprised and uh, less worried to see it go to 0 0.01. That would be perfectly realistic. X5 is not that much with penny stocks, so um, if they get some great news with the lawsuit, I think not financial advice, once again, disclaimer, but uh, I think that it can go easily to 0 0.022 here. X5, 0 0.0011. And a uh, 20022 x10 here at 0 0.022. So people were asking, what's the realistic price prediction if they win the lawsuit? I think that 0 0.0010 to 0 0.0020 is perfectly realistic, and it can happen because we have more and more people being bullish following HMC. To the group on Trading212, they're one of the biggest group with 10,000 people in HMC. So people are heavily invested and are looking at HMC and are waiting for the lawsuit. Now HMC released the news here. Also, we had some great news here with HMC. Borsha recommends it now 88% buy, which is complete here. Great for HMC. We've seen Borsha recommend them a couple weeks ago at 16%, 24%, and now we can see 
88% overall buy, which is a really, really good. They're very bullish on HMC, so that's everything we have to see. HMC at 88%. I was completely stunned when I saw it. 88%. I remember seeing here overall average 22, 16% from bar short. So bar short is getting very, very bullish on HMC, which is very, very great news. Now we got some news here with HMC. If you take a look here on the website of HMC, let's take a look at the HMC website. They released some news today regarding the, the, the direct offering. And some people are also saying HMC is HMC earnings today. I saw that they were projected today, but the, the CEO didn't come forward talking about earnings. So we'll have to see. Maybe they will drop their earnings today, or maybe it's just an estimation and it will come this month. But uh, we'll have to see the news here. Take a look at the news. HMC in the news. HMC informs stockholders of key dates and terms related to announced right offering. Record it established as May 18, 2021 to be a shareholder of record investors are advised to own HMC stock by 4 p.m. ET Friday, May 14 to account for trade plus two settlement timing. HMC, okay, 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 okay. HMC common stock by May 13, 2021 to be considered a stockholder of record on a record date. Under the proposed rights offering, HMC will distribute one non-transferable subscription right for each four shares of common stock held by a stockholder on the record date of May 18th. Each subscription will right entitle the holder to purchase one share of HMC common stock as a subscription price equal to 0 0.75 of the volume with an average trading. Okay, 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 25 discount. The subscription right will be non-transferable and may only be exercised during the anticipated subscription period of May 19 on June through 5 p.m. on June 3rd. The expected calendar for the rights offering is as follow Friday, May 14, ownership day. In order to be considered a stockholder of record on May 18, shares will be acquired by May 14. Tuesday, record date 21, May 19, distribution date, subscription period begins. June 3rd, subscription period ends. Holders who exercise their subscription rights in full will be entitled, if available, to subscribe for additional units to are not purchased by stockholders on a pro data basis and subject to ownership limitation. This is referred to as oversubscription rights. So um, very technical stuff here. This press release does not constitute an offer to sell. Okay, so um, I don't think that a lot of investors will take a look at that. Maybe some investors are interested, but uh, I think that all the, the major part of the community is invested for the lawsuit and we'll take a look at the lawsuit. So uh, we'll see what people think about that. But uh, the lawsuit, people are focusing on the lawsuit. All their attention right now is on the lawsuit. And I'm very curious to see when, because maybe it will come this month, the, the judge will respond this month. And I'm very curious to see what the judge will say if he grants or, or denies the motion to dismiss. So that will be very, very interesting. And if you take a look here, we get some what people were saying on the Reddit pages still over 0 0.002 even after the pump and dumpers we are still over 0 0.002 still a win in my book let's keep holding mids that's what i was saying also people came we saw a big spike in hmc but uh, it's still up it was also at trading at 24 30 so that was great now it's back to 21 maybe today we'll go back to 18 and all this will be maybe some people make some gains at 35 but uh when it go back if it goes back to 0 0.0018 nothing really changed maybe you made some gains at the top but uh it, if it goes back to those levels nothing changed people made some gains people made some losses that's what happens but um i'm thinking the same let's see tomorrow's earnings them right could have sold at 35 but held let's keep new level of 0 0.002 and 0 0.03 after er then judge say that's that's possible if judge says if judge says that he denies the motion to dismiss 0 0.0075 0 0.1 like i said i want to be surprised to see do x5 now with the response of the judge x5 can happen but uh, if with the lawsuit x5 will be more realistic but uh, let's see maybe it will double triple with the response of the judge we'll have to see i'll be very happy at half a penny then we go to one penny we're holding for the big payout don't see a point of selling before the lawsuit is won but i can myself sell for anything less than 0.69 yes i'm holding for 0.67 0.65 how many shares are you holding to sell 2 million if it goes below 0.02 this week, it seems it just means it's discounted price before a 25% opportunity. Keep buying long and holding long time. If it drops below 0.02, I will definitely be buying more. Yeah, let's see what people are saying here. Up to 100k shares. HMC, goodbye, May 3rd. Back to business. As I said in my previous video, May 3rd was a dream. Anybody who pumped HMC on May 3rd has no idea what the stock is about. The rights offering means the price is staying at lower level right now is not a bad thing if you've done your research you know this 
170 patterns via SPM EcoS product is also converted in above clip. That's the play. Be patient. Be patient. Let's see who will win in the long term. Simple and sweet. HMC and Dogecoin equals a Lambo. Very, very, very funny. Earnings may report fifth. So um, people are speculating May fifth, and we we've seen that a website projected it on May fifth, but uh, nothing regarding the the CEO. Nothing said for the CEO here, and also regarding the CEO. Uh, we have an interview coming with the CEO, so that will be a very interesting and very great and historic day interview with the CEO with all your questions that you submitted. That will be very, very interesting and I can't wait to interview him. So that will be a very great day. Buying more now. Thanks for the discount. Paper hands. Predictions. HMC Vitamin Store 10% promo. Why are we panicking? Today is your last chance. Don't miss out. Yesterday was a pump and dump. Okay, that was two days ago. Still holding to one. Rising uh, open at May 4. So right now we're one hour before the market open. I'm very curious to see how the market will open today. Maybe it will go once again back to, to 0 0.0018. That's how it is. People were all jumping on HMC day. Made maybe some gains, maybe some losses, but we'll see in the long term who will win. And I'm very curious in HMC for the long term. So we'll see. Who supported HMC today? A voice, please. We love HMC. We love HMC. So um, let's see here. HMC, short will hurry today. What's the moral of the story? That's what we we're talking about yesterday. So we're up to date here with HMC and uh, it's looking very, very great. What I really like is that investors and analysts are very bullish on HMC, so that's awesome. We have also 10,000 people, the number one group on on uh, trading to one two app, so that's a great news. And I was just thinking here, let's take a look at what investors have been investing in, our favorite investors. We love to take a look at Katy Wood or Kinvest. Let's take a look here, Katy Wood. She's been going all in yesterday in DraftKings for 576,000 shares, Palantir 1,000 share. RGM 100,000, Trilio 100,000, Skills 2,000, Path 200,000, and here Skills 2 million shares in Skills, 190,000 in Coinbase. She's been going all in in DraftKings, Skills, and Coinbase. GD 100,000, Unity 65,000. So she's been going all in in the tech. That's awesome to see. Ice STNE bot in ORGG. Let's take a look. ORGG, what she got in. RG Z C M E E U. Okay, nice. And org W. Let's take a look in org W. The org W Baidu sold 10 set holdings, 55,000 Coinbase, 22,000 skills, 300,000. So yesterday she's been going all in in DraftKings, in Palantir, Palantir not so much, in skills and a path also here, path and Coinbase, skills, Coinbase, path, DraftKings, been going all in. That's beautiful for ORK Invest and Katy Wood. We like to take a look at what big investors invest in because we can see if there's some great opportunities and we can have some ideas to what stocks to invest in. In the description, there's a link to Webull. You can get two free stocks when you deposit $100. And in the description, there's also a link to my Patreon. You can get access to my four portfolios and you can also get access to the Discord where we talk all day long about the best stocks to buy. It's really, really fun. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. Drop in the comments your price prediction for HMC. I'm very curious so we can have a discussion, a conversation. Thank you for watching. Remember that everything I said is for entertainment purposes only. No financial advice here. Thanks for watching. Thank you for your support. Thank you for, for watching. I'm repeating myself. I'll see you in the next one.